Yes, hello again, comrades. Yes, hello again, friends and fans. Raptor here, and welcome to Workers and Resources, Soviet Republic. It is a pleasure to have you here. Oh, man, the music is just kicking up. I'm loving it. As we now are tasked with building our own glorious nation, check this out. We've got all this territory to build in between the Western powers and the Eastern Bloc. We will build ourselves a glorious nation of Raptoria. So welcome, everybody. Good to have you all here as we initiate our construction on our glorious empire. we got a lot of space to build in. Look at all this. Wow. Actually, this might be a good spot to build in. Check this out. We actually have a... Wow. This music is tight, dude. We got a really good spot here. Well, let it let it go for a second. Oh yeah, that's what I want to hear. All right, glorious music, too glorious. Let's pop that down a little bit. Ooh, I can almost uh, almost hear myself over the glory. Okay, so today we're going to build ourselves a glorious empire. We'll need to connect to the Soviet Union or the Western Bloc pigs, so that way we can build ourselves a glorious empire, comrades. And today we will do just that. So let's get started. Let's build ourselves some wonderful roads and uh, tenement buildings and so much more. Wow, look at this. We can actually build railways and all sorts of different things. Oh, I've never done that before. Okay, let's go ahead and get started and build ourselves a wonderful, uh, I guess, main drive here. Wait, no, 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 no. Let's flatten out some of the land first. There we go. Let's make it nice and big. There we go. Let's flatten all this land out. It's going to cost us a pretty penny or a pretty ruble, I guess, in this case. But it'll be perfect for building all of our future town. There we go. All right, that should be a good spot to start. Very good. All right, let's put down our road then. And this should be our uh, glorious road into the center of town. And we'll build a uh, road that comes down this way as well. Fantastic. All right, that has all lighting. Excellent. Now we just need to uh, build some construction offices and get things working. All right, let's get started with the construction office. We'll build that uh, somewhere near the uh, center of town. And, of course, in this we'll be building uh, workers' barracks and uh, logging and doing all sorts of different things. Almost like a Tropico and City Skylines kind of come together. It's almost like a communist mod for it. Okay, construction down. Excellent. Let's build ourselves some homes. Let's start with a couple of uh, flats over here. And uh, I think we'll build uh, maybe two over here. Start with one there. Yes. Mm, that music's so powerful. Brings a tear to my eye. All right, let's go ahead and get two uh, big apartment buildings down. All right, so the office, or the construction office is building these. In addition to that, we're also going to need to uh, do some uh, important things such as farming and logging. And so let's get to that as well. We'll build ourselves a uh, gravel road, I think, that goes up here. And uh, then we'll start logging, giving our people something to do in our glorious, wonderful nation of Raptoria. Excellent. We shall bring glory to our people as long as we can build ourselves a road. There we go. Let's level out the terrain a little bit. There we go. And we'll build that all the way up to the top. All right, that should do well. Uh, let's hope that that works. Perfect. Oh, yeah, that helps. Excellent. All the way to the top. And there they go. All right, fantastic. So in this game, our people obviously don't have cars because that is a luxury for the capitalist. Actually, we can choose to go any way we want, really. Uh, we can build on the other side and see uh, NATO forces over there as well. They're indicated... Uh, all the way over the, on that side where we can connect to multiple different towns all the way around. It's like we're between, uh, it's almost like we're East Germany, uh, somewhere around East Germany uh, and the Soviet Union and the Western powers because a lot of the names of those towns sometimes look to be uh, Western Bloc. So let's go ahead and start building a few extra things. We'll get all of our buildings started and then we'll start inviting people here. So let's get uh, construction going for, uh, let's see, woodcutter. There we are. So plenty of things to do with the woodcutter office. Go ahead and build that there, boys. Excellent. And we'll get a sawmill down the road a little bit. Mm. Music is awesome, dude. Dramatic. Okay, now, uh, a few other things we should do is uh, build a... Uh, let's see, we'll need a bus stop to get up there. We'll need a warehouse to store everything down here. But we can also switch our uh, plan and ship directly to the customs office to make money there. So let's go ahead and uh, construct ourselves some more industry. Let's go with farming next. That's going to be important. Uh, I think we'll build a road further down. Ah, oh, the music is so good. Excellent. There we go. It's good. And we'll uh, build it this way, I suppose. There we go. Okay, now we'll put down our farm. Let's see. Farm. Food and crop related buildings here under our agro farm. I guess it's a little upset. All right, there we go. We'll build a bus stop over here, too, so our people can reach it. Flatten out the land. 
And good. All right, construction begins. A couple of small fields here. Let's see if we can uh, build those. Uh, need flat terrain. Oh, there we go. That'll do. And that too. Excellent. Okay, we'll, we'll start with that. And we should be able to start with our uh, workers coming up here to the sawmill too. Before we do anything else, we better get it organized for uh, busing. So we're going to need ourselves, let's see, a road depot. Uh, let's see, road vehicle depot. This is where we'll purchase all of our vehicles for our glorious empire. Oh, yes. Uh, I think we'll put it uh, somewhere near the center of town. Somewhere like over here. That's perfect. Excellent. Not everything has to be connected to roads, but that will be uh, needing to be connected. And let's see, bus platform. We'll do a couple of small platforms here. Let's see, we'll uh, connect it up this way, I think. And we'll connect the main town uh, to the farming area. We'll uh, make a little connection over here. Actually, might want to build it back here. Let's see if we can do that. Uh, nope, road's in the way. All right, we'll have to build it over here. Perfect. And then we'll circle that back around. Excellent. All right, so that way they can get to all the places down there for work here. And then finally, the glorious People's Sawmill of Liberation and Happiness is its official name. Let's go ahead and uh, put down another bus stop here. And I believe the buses can just turn around, so we don't need to connect it through. So uh, we put it there. Yep, perfect. Okay, let's buy some buses so we can get people uh, moving. Uh, vehicle Depot here. Uh, let's buy a new bus. I think we'll go with uh, we'll go with three buses here. And let's set up bus number one. Yes. All right. So Chav here is going to go from the center of town down to the uh, farm and back. We'll set that one up. And we'll have bus number two go from, uh, let's see, the center of town uh, to the sawmill and back. And then we'll have the final bus. Let's go ahead and launch that one, too. Oh, here we go. Nice 1980s Soviet music. Yes, break it down, comrade. Get jiggy with it. Equally as much as others. Not too much jiggy. Only a little bit. All right. All right, let's see. Did I... I think I added to this one. Ah, this is the one. Okay, we added to the other one, but that's okay. They'll have equal uh, amount of stops. And we can always organize it and come back later. There won't be too many people to start with. All right, nobody lives in our town yet. So we will have to bribe them. <laughs> to come to our wonderful country. All right, so buses are rolling around. Excellent. Now let's go ahead and invite 10 immigrants from the Soviet bloc. And we will start working. We're going to need a lot of workers. So let's get to it. All right, a couple other things that we need. We need to feed our people. So let's build uh, some stuff for that. So let's see if we got a food building here. A uh, grocery store. There we are. And if we zoom in, we'll build that in the center of town. Perfect. Excellent. All right, that'll be built shortly, and then we'll buy some food. But then we'll be able to make our own food as soon as our farm is up and running. So it's not too long until we're good to go there. Okay, so let's see. We've got our wonderful uh, street here. You can see the downtown area starting to grow. And uh, buses are coming up here. Next thing is we're going to need to buy some trucks for the loggers to bring the logs back uh, from the logging site to the main building. So let's go with three of these. And then we're going to need some trucks to transport the logs from the lumber, uh, the, like the lumber site to the sawmill. So let's buy three of those, or maybe actually just two might. Actually, let's let's try this. Uh, let's do a, uh, let's see, open haul. That'll be fine. Now let's buy one of these big boys. And uh, actually, let's buy two. I got a plan. Just like our economy, a planned one. There we are. All right, so what we're going to do is uh, bring logs to the sawmill to be turned to boards, and then boards will be brought to the custom house to trade with the Soviet Union, making us glorious. Money? I, uh oh I kind of feel bad saying that. All right, anyway, we'll continue on. We'll build another one from the saw, uh, logging site, sawmill, and then back to uh, the Soviet border. Where we'll trade for money. Excellent. Now let's do the same with the farm. We'll need some extra stuff to help out here. So let's go with, uh, let's see, we need a couple of tractors to help with the sewing. We'll go with four of those for two fields, two for each. And then something for harvesting. Let's go with uh, two of those. And then something to transport all the goods back to the uh, back to the main uh, area. Let's go with two of those. 
that should be able to transport it to uh, food uh, to the food factory. But we'll get to that soon. We'll use those two trucks and eventually start trading with the Soviets and uh, see if we, we can trade crops directly. First, we need money. But we got plenty of money to start with. Nine million. So much, much, much big money. All right, let's take a look at population. All right, we got 200 people living here. Let's see what else they need. Uh, Ten workers without jobs. Okay, we're working on that. And we have the food going on too, right? Oh, actually, we need to work on food now. Okay. We're going to auto-purchase a ton of food for our people. And we'll go with the auto plan. Excellent. So this will automatically buy food from the Soviet Union until we actually have enough of our own, uh, the whole plan working, so that way we can uh, be self-sufficient. All right, I don't think we can do anything on the river, unfortunately. No farming, no uh, shipping up and down the Volga or whatnot, but uh, it's all good. Uh, let's see, and a beautiful train coming in, too. I think we could build a warehouse over here, but for now, we'll just directly trade with the Soviet Union. All right, well, let's go ahead and get some more uh, things for our people. Let's get some... Uh, Let's see, I want to build a educational building down. Uh, let's see, education related. Medical university. Oh, we don't need... Oh, there used to be elementary schools and such. Uh, we could put some entertainment down, though. Let's put a football field down. There we go. Excellent. All right, looks like the school problem has been solved. I'm uh, playing on, uh, I think, medium right now. When I played previously, I changed the setting to make... Uh, it require a kindergarten and a regular school, but it seems like all we need here is... I guess this is more simplified. Disappointing. I'd rather have the school, but that's okay. I guess one less building to build, and we can focus on our glorious industry. Now, we have no power right now. What? That's right, we have absolutely no electricity. Let's take a look and see if it actually tells us that. It should tell us that we don't have any electricity. Uh, unspecified workers waiting. No, it doesn't... doesn't uh, there's no problems with the electricity at the moment, but that's something we now need to build and trade with the Soviet Union. Now that everything's built up, uh, does it say without power? Uh, let's see. No education. Uh, let's see. No jobs. No electronics. What? We should be able to provide electronics here, or electricity at least. Let's take a look here. Well, regardless, we know we need it, so we're going to go ahead and provide the electricity needed. Dude, that is cool. I love that building. All right, let's put down a substation. Uh, let's see. Construction related. Oh, wait. Actually, I think it should be under infrastructure. No, under... No energy? 